So I'll show you another basic footwork exercise for, uh, to start with. This time, which you can start incorporating a little bit. It's very simple, just lift. See, my quad is coming in and the foot goes out this way and then down. Really important here is the articulation of the foot. See how it's, it's up like that. One kicks. Now look at the articulation of the foot. So it comes back, knee joint bends, and we step. So my quad is in. I'm not straight like this. My quad is in. Knee is slightly bent. Again, you should feel like you could hold a tennis ball here in your quad, and then in, and then out. Control again. The leg strength needed for this is out. Then we want to. So again, this rotational figure of eight movement, just like in in Chen Tai Chi. Lift. This time the foot is pointed to the floor, just like in traditional towel loop, only the body is a little bit more rounded. And then just point back, foot articulates, knee articulates, change figure of eight. Same the other way. Foot is dragged back, foot is pointing down, change point. Foot articulates, knee articulates, and then front leg goes down. Oh, and here's the other thing. If you lose your balance, don't ever give in. If you want to develop real skill, um, I lose my balance all the time. I don't mind anyone seeing that. Um, the important thing is, as with all of us, you never give in. The more you fight for that balance, the more your balance will improve. Um, and then articulate and down. Now there's more advanced movements um, based around these postures that I'm going to show you. So, but I'm going to do that in a separate. Let's do that in a separate video, you know, at least because um, with a broken or at least heavily bruised, I'm hoping rib, um, these postures are very difficult for me at the moment. But um, one of the things we should understand about whole body power is that people think it's just about force, just about hitting. If people have genuine whole body power, they should be able to do some um, quite unusual things in terms of strength. And I'm telling you, no one ever sees me do weights on my legs because I don't, I don't do it. I mean, I might be a Taolu athlete, but I don't do weights on my legs. Um, the people who do down at the gym have no idea how I do this kind of thing. Um, but well, really, it's just about how relaxed, just getting your muscles down to using the minimum, minimum amount of muscles necessary, and then again okay, articulate and down. I'm going to do another video where I just explain how to do, you know, how to build up to um, using your your musculature in a superior way. That's not about doing weights on your legs or anything like that. I don't look particularly, I mean I'm in shape but I don't look particularly muscular. I've not got big muscles on my legs. Um, I've got Nanchuan calves um, after years of Nanchuan but um, you know it's not about muscles at all and, and I even tried at first like to do weights to try and get this and then um, I remember Wang Shunjai saying it's nothing, it's not about, they tried that, Wang Shunjai tried that and then they realised it's not about that and once you kind of realise it that it's about reducing the amount of muscles that you use. It's not about putting more muscles on. It's about reducing unnecessary tension, um, which just suddenly transforms. It's like being, it's like gravity changes um, because unnecessary tension in your musculature just slows you down and makes you feel heavier. So that's one of the things that we're trying to develop. Anyway, that's our, that's our footwork exercise. So it's very simply just out like that and you can see I've got a video up of the toe bunger where you boom you just kick someone with your 
the toes of your foot and they're here, hopefully they'll play. It's very much just like that.